call the meeting to order. At this time, I'd like to call on Commissioner Ordenstein. He's going to lead us in the invocation and the pledge. Bow with me. Father God, Lord, we come to you tonight <coughs> expressing our gratitude, Lord, and praise to you for all the many blessings of life, Lord. We thank you for our community and those who, who live here and participate in making our community a better place. Lord, we ask that you bless our meeting tonight. You give us wisdom and strength. And we'll give you, in Jesus Christ, the honor and glory. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. 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 Thank you
or excuse me, the county utility standards and specifications for booster pumps uh, in Lowndes County for the water distribution system require that they be a peerless pump. The sole source for these pumps is Synchro Flow, located out of Norcross, Georgia. Um, staff is requesting that we purchase uh, the, uh, the pump independently of the South Interperimeter Road Utility Extension Project in order to eliminate time delays and save some uh, money through uh, sales tax and contractor markup. It will be delivered the week of December the 14th. Okay. Any questions for Mr. Fletcher? Hearing none, I'll entertain a motion. Make a motion to approve an issue purchase order for booster pump independently because the Board of Commissioners determined there's only one source for the required pump. Okay. We have a motion. Do we have a second? Second. We have a second. Any discussion on the motion? Hearing none, we'll call the vote. All in favor, signify by aye. Aye. Uh, any opposed, like sign. Hearing none, the motion carries. We'll now move on to agenda item 6E. Commissioners, as, as you recall, this was uh, an added agenda item. Uh, this particular agenda item had been brought up at one point uh, a few weeks ago, um, and it failed to pass. However, I have had some requests from commissioners to bring this back up and get it on the agenda for your reconsideration, which is, I made that request uh, yesterday at the work session, uh, got the support for it to, to be reconsidered, and so I, it is brought before you now to reconsider. The consideration um, is, is requested for the urban transit study in the amount of $6,252 and the truck traffic study in the amount of $8,845. Do we have any questions? Mr. Any Chairman, I'd just like to thank yourself and the Commission for uh, reconsidering this request. Uh, you know, uh, I think it's important that we continue to support our commitment to MPO and ultimately the citizens of Lowndes County. Okay. Any other questions or comments? Okay. There are none, then we'll call the vote. All in. I mean, I'm sorry. We need a motion. Mr. Chairman, I move that we um, approve the NPO request uh, for the transit study and the uh, truck traffic study for the amount of $15,097. That is the total of $62.52 and $88.45. That's okay. right. All right. Then, so we have a motion to approve the two studies, both the truck traffic study and the urban transit study. We have a second. Second. We have a second. Is there any discussion on the motion? Okay. We'll call the vote. We'll do it by a show of hands. All in favor, signify by raising your right hand. We have three. Any opposed, like sign. Votes three to two. The motion passed. Okay, we'll now move on. Um, we have no, the, oh, I'm sorry, county manager's report, Mr. Crick. No additional report, Mr. Chairman. All righty, and no citizens wishing to be heard. All right, I've got one other little thing that uh, I'd like to bring up and just really recognize a group of people, if I can, just a minute. And really, this is just kind of a, this is something that I really uh, feel real strong about. A lot of the, a lot of the community departments that we work with uh, really doesn't get the credit, the just credit they get for the job that they do for our community. And we've got a lot of department heads and a lot of different people that do a great job in this community, but this particular one that I wanted to single out this afternoon is Public Works. Um, Ms. Cumbus is not with us here today, but I do want to share with you just some of the things. This is from a June report that was given out, um, and I'm just going to highlight on a few of the high points. There were 843 hours that were performed by community service workers at no charge to the county. Again, that was supervised by Public Works. 250 bags of garbage was picked up by the probationers, um, again, supervised by, by Public Works. They had, on administrative on-call, personal dispatched 18-hour calls 
uh, in June. Nine calls were for trees in the road. One call was for a washout. One call for potholes in the road. Five calls for uh, alarms that were going off. One call for power outage. One call for plumbing problems at the 4-H camp. Um, and again, their average response time to any of these issues uh, were, was two hours. Again, that's great response time to the needs of the citizens, um, and not only the citizens, but the employees of Lowndes <coughs> County as well. Some other high notes, 637 road miles were graded in the month of June. A tremendous amount of work there. This one is a little bit troubling, and this is something that we're going to have to address as we move forward, but again, th these are just factual information that's provided. 8.74 tons of mixed bulky waste was collected from the roads and illegal dumping in Lowndes County just in one month. It's a huge number. 106 work orders were completed in facilities maintenance during June. Again, that's a huge workload to be completing work orders uh, just in one month. Another number that just really jumps out at you, 19,136 pieces of mail were processed for Lowndes County in the month of June. Um, and this one right here is extremely important, commissioners. And again, they did all this work and a lot other, a lot of other works with zero accidents resulting in medical medical attention and no lost time during the month of June. Wow. So not only doing a great job for Lowndes County, but doing it very, very safely for their employees. And um, I, I wish Robin was here to get a little bit of recognition for that. But again, I want to just commend not only Robin, but her staff in Public Works for a great job that they do for this community. And again, if you get the opportunity, please let her know that, and as well as a lot of the other department heads, too, and the great jobs that they do. So again, thank you all very much. All right. See any other business? Hearing none, I'll entertain a motion to adjourn. Motion to adjourn. Motion to adjourn.